guys welcome back to my channel in today's video we're outside it is my favorite video of life it's the fall porch refresh um, I'm feeling a little discouraged because I can't find any like real pumpkins right now so I will probably add pumpkins later on but in today's video I don't have any because I can't find any but in my first clip you saw me pulling up the wagon and I filled it with water to soak the mums that I just got at Costco People are telling me that that works and helps prolong their life so we're gonna do that and I want to um, clean off the porch I want to pot up a really fun um, pot at the end of the porch you guys have seen my little metal um, long thing before and we just got some fun things to do so I hope you'll join me and without further ado let's get going sorry about the wind but I pulled out or I not pulled out I pulled those out because I thought that those might be fun for some things on the porch and I have some little mums I have some um, of this stuff I'm not sure what it is sweet potato vine I I don't know I just liked the color um, some cabbage and some pansies and then I got a couple different sizes of cabbage these ones are very big from the local nursery and then these ones were just from Home Depot but I feel like we can make something really cute with the orange and white mums and then these gorgeous uh, burgundy mums. Okay, before we move on to the pots, I want to share these faux cypress spheres with you. I got these sent to me by a company called My Poetry. They have several different like faux topiary options for outdoor. And I have been loving these on my porch this just like uh, last month of summer because if you remember, I um, had nothing on my porch all summer. And so we repainted the black, so the black looks nice now, and then we have these. And I think these are like, I picked the cypress because I thought that it would go um, great for summer, fall, and even into winter. And so I'm really excited about them. The quality is so good. I was a little skeptical when I first pulled it out of the box, but they have eventually just like fluffed out. They're so full. I mean, it's just beautiful. It comes in just a black pot um, to just be popped down into another pot, or you don't even need to. You could just use the black pot that it came with. But I am so gracious that um, they reached out to me because I had been looking for something. I had those um, trees in my porch um, 
last year, if you remember the ones from Hobby Lobby, and they were cute, but I just wanted something fuller. And so these were perfect. And they have offered my viewers a 10% discount if you just use the code crystal and it's crystal with a K. So I will leave it all the info in the description box if you guys wanna check them out. I feel like the price is very reasonable and then obviously an extra bonus with the 10% off. But without that, I feel like they are worth the price and um, I, I'm really excited about them. All right, in my pot here, I have old soil. Well, it's not new, it's not old, it's from the summer. It's all, it was new in the summer, but we're gonna just hopefully hope that it works because I don't have any more potting soil, but I have um, these vines that I thought we could put in here, like maybe like that. And then I have two cabbages I thought we could put like this. And then I have several mums that I was thinking we could put kind of this um, these need watered so bad it's kind of like that and then maybe another one in the middle and then I have these pansies that I kind of just want to tuck in anywhere that we can I love pansies in the fall and spring and my actual pansies that I had in my front porch they lasted um, most of the summer too so anyway I think I think we're gonna go with that so let's pot it up we're gonna have to water these in because I am terrible about taking I'm good at taking care of plants when they're potted and beautiful but in containers I'm terrible at it so I'm loving this so let's go ahead and just get them all potted in and watered in really well and I think she's adorable.
can hear me. Don't mind the sun. The sun's going down. It's 4.30 on Sunday. And before we go, I am so excited. So you see the two lights that we have here but on the other side of our door. I love those lights so, so much. And I kept thinking, like, I would love to have those lights on either side of the garage because um, currently there are no lights. And so I got a bid, um, cars passing by, sorry. I got a bid to see what it would cost to put them up. It was reasonable, so we did it. And I'm so happy. So if you saw my video on Sunday, you saw that we have cleaned our garage. We've, I'm parking in the garage. And so there's nobody parking in the driveway. And so I got some mums to go on either side of the garage with my lights. And I wanna show you guys but I have to get closer to the camera to speak because it is a little windy out here. So I will show you guys that and then I will let you go. Thank you for being here today and joining me. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. It really helps my channel out and I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye.